Major announcement by Governor Newsom today. Sunnyvale has been chosen to be the headquarters for the new National Semiconductor Technology Center. ABC 7 News South Bay reporter Zach Fuentes has more on how the announcement can impact the entire Bay Area. Electronics are part of everyday lives, and semiconductors are the technology behind everything from phones to cars. Now Sunnyvale will be a key location where those semiconductors will be made and improved, leading to no shortage of possibilities for technological innovation and advancement. The U.S. Department of Commerce chose the city to be home to the headquarters for the new National Semiconductor Technology Center. So this is a big deal because it reinforces California's status as a leader, as an innovator, but it also reinforces our value. Proposition. The news was announced by Governor Gavin Newsom Friday. It's drawn lots of excitement. The center is expected to drive more than $1 billion in research funding and create more than 200 direct jobs over the next 10 years. I'm just overjoyed to see that Sunnyvale was the chosen location. Sunnyvale Mayor Larry Klein said the city's ready to welcome new talent and has already worked on long-term planning to add office, housing, and retail space. So that there's additional places for our partners to grow but also housing for people to live here, for the employees and, and all, the, all the scientists that will be part of this project have a place to, in Sunnyvale. The news also means chances for students at nearby universities to collaborate on cutting-edge semiconductor research. There will be an internship, there will be uh, places where there will be some projects, there will be some grants. Uh, all of this one will open the door for strengthening the relationship between the academic world and the government and the industry itself. There have long been concerns about the U.S.'s reliance on semiconductors being made overseas. The Chips and Science Act, which is behind the new facility, has aimed to ramp up America's ability to design, develop, and manufacture its own semiconductors. Silicon Valley will go back to the golden days where, when it started with the semiconductor, we don't have to rely on anybody outside the United States to build and to design our chips. Mayor Klein said that right now, there are general ideas as to where the center will be located in Sunnyvale, but until that's finalized, there's no announcement yet. In Sunnyvale, Zach Fuentes, ABC7 News.